former agency operative Rico Rodriguez. Up to this point, his whereabouts have been unknown since our withdrawal from Medici. Responsible for deposing half a dozen heads of state. The Black Hand have encountered him before in San Espirito, where he assassinated our employer, President Salvador Mendoza. We fought him again in Medici, where he overthrew Sebastiano Di Ravello. Though the agency had some involvement, and this is his handler, Tom Sheldon, we've learned Rodriguez's motivation for liberating Medici was personal. You have briefed me on this man before, Commander Morales. We're preparing a test. Can we cut to the chase, por favor? Of course, Senor Spinoza. Intelligence suggests that he is the son of Miguel Rodriguez. My Miguel Rodriguez? Mm. Huh. And? And he's here, in Solis, now. So, that's my father's super weapon. Project Tiapa. He was a kind man, my father. A scientist. Doesn't make sense he would build such a thing. My uncle was a good man, too. And they both ended up dead. Lots of questions, hmm? Time to get some answers. You can't do this alone. I have people who can help us. Here, I've done this kind of thing before. This is different. I can handle some bad weather. It's more than bad weather, Rico. If you would just listen to me. Mira, a plan is a list of things that go wrong. I like to keep my list short. Just be ready. When I patch you into that console, you'll have to find Espinosa quickly. He answers my questions. We destroy Project Iapa. Plan. Hmm? Well? Buena suerte. Oscar Espinosa, better be ready to talk. Comms check. Here you loud and clear. I'm going to monitor your progress from a safe distance. The road is walled off. Can you get over it? Okay. Where to now? Those lights across the valley? Head towards them. That's a big tower. Espinosa promises it will change the world. No more tornadoes or hurricanes. And most of Solis believes him. Project Iapa won't be a problem after today, Mira. If your plan works. It will work. <laughs> Made it. Bueno. Follow the piping. You're gonna come face to face with the Black Hand. We've come face to face before. Heading up. too happy to have me poking around. The Black Hand are highly trained mercs, and they're wholly owned by Espinosa. His own private army. Pretty good one, too. <laughs> Not good enough. I see those outcroppings. You're on the right track. Can you get across? <laughs> no sweat. Super 
Project the upper. Rico, there's a console further up this structure. Not sure how I'll you'll... figure it out. Here. I'm through security. Just hang in a few more seconds and you'll be able to move, Rico. I'm looking for him. Take your time. It's unlikely he has survived this long. This is not an ordinary man, Senor Spinoza. See, 
We might as well make sure. Si, Senor Espinosa. Let's see what Project Diapa can do, shall we? Senor. It'll take a few moments for the core to reach full power. Do you think you can keep him occupied until then? This is Commander Morales. We have a threat on sight. Activate Yapa's defenses. Engage all artillery towers. That woman, with Rico at the airport. Is that who I think it was? See. Si. Deal with that, please. With pleasure. Mira. Come in, Rico. Please respond. Mira. Rico. Ay, Dios mío, you're alive. I lost your GPS. See, si, my grappling hook's broken. So is my wingsuit. Parachute. Maybe a few ribs. I'll need to make repairs. I have tools at El Abismo. What's your location? Forest? I don't know. I'm sending you my coordinates. Hope it works. Got it. I'll see you soon. Shit. Not having my grappling hook is like missing a limb. That looks like the place. Never seen anything like Yapa before. Uh, Mira might be right. Mira, I'm at El Abismo. People here must not be afraid of heights. I know you're not. I'm not, but I usually have a parachute. Chopper. That's no good. Empty it out fast. Half the people leaving here are trying to get away from Espinosa and his black hand. Awful. Agua? The Black Hand are casing the village. Does that happen often? Almost never. Maybe somebody attacked their weather base. Yeah. Tools? Gracias. I 
I don't think I could take Project Diapa alone. I agree. I'm saying I was wrong. You were right. Is that a distress signal? I didn't think you were with the agency anymore. Help me with this. What do we do about Iapa? Between the blizzard and those artillery towers, I can't get close. I have a couple of ideas. Tell me. Wait. Listen. Your actions in the next few minutes may determine the fate of this community. I'm Commander Morales. I have tolerated El Abismo for years. To maintain order and justice in Solis, I've allowed this place to serve as a refuge for the criminal and the disenfranchised. But last night, a terrorist attack was launched against the Project Iyapa facility. The culprit was abetted by a conspirator from this village. Who is that? Gabriela. She killed my uncle when I was a girl. She knows we're working together. If Mira Morales is not surrendered to me immediately, I'll be forced to conduct an exhaustive investigation. Every home will be searched. Every citizen's identity will be checked. And all transgressions will be harshly prosecuted. <laughs> you! Luis! Where is Mira? Where? I have to stop this! Gabriela! Let him go, cousin! At least you aren't a coward. Your father would be disgusted with the monster you've become. You two traitors can discuss your disappointment together, in prison. Lord to my chopper! Mira! I think we just started a rebellion. We didn't have to drag these people into this. They are what we need to put down Project Diapa. Well, they'll need more guns. Eso. There's a factory down the road from here. Abandoned. Casquillos vacíos. It used to manufacture black hand weapons years ago. Let's check it out. Luis, right? Organize these people. Anyone who wants to fight the black hand gets to fight. Show up for it, Sargento? Si, senor. Mira, I need to make sure my gear is working. I'll meet you at the factory. <laughs> Hope everything works. Ha! Perfect! Oye, Rico! It's Luis. Uh, I mean, Sargento here. Mira a mí, un mincho a casquillos vacíos.
At the factory. Sargento and Izzy did some research. They can help you get this place up and running. Who's Izzy? Hola. I'm the hacker. Uh, hi. Patch what you've got. Dear AR lens, Mira told me. Already done. You have an AR lens? Like a little computer on your eyeball? Something like that. Let's get started. Generator down. Yeah. Okay. Two more to go. You know where to look. into the black end plums and they're on their way. Pick up the pace hardware. Mission accepted, Sargento. Your AR lens will show you where to look. It's only a matter of time before Gabriela sends more Black Ant to stop us. We need to get these people gone fast. Generators are all off. And the door's just opened. Choppers and roofs headed this way, Rico. Better wake this place up or we'll be fighting them off with sticks and stones. I'm heading in. Find the breakers and flip them. Hmm. Need to use my grappling hook. Here's the other one. Breakers are on. And the Black Hand are almost here. Just hit the master override. Mira, we're in business. Let's call everyone in. Just give the order. Ale, let's kick some ass. Rico, you should get back outside. You got us those guns just in time. They Black Hand are deploying their forces across the river. We won't be able to advance the line without more fighters. Any ideas? We became soldiers after what you did in the slums. Create more chaos. More recruits will come. A whole army of chaos. This is what you wanted from the start. Oscar Espinosa owns this island. The people can't fight him without losing their jobs, their homes. And even if they tried, what chance would they have against a Black Hand? We have a mutual goal, Rico. You help these people defeat the Black Hand, and we'll help you get to Oscar Espinosa. Okay, Mira. We'll do it your way. What's first? I got some ideas, Rico. I will ready your eyeball with more information. Whole army of chaos. Sure. 
army of chaos. Surprise for you. Here, I'll send you the coordinates. Load up the truck. We're leaving in sixty seconds. Did you organize this ambush? See. Si. Most of the stuff he recovered is standard black ammunition. But I also found some of these. We're not sure what they do. We didn't want to mess with them. Um, there's a bunch more left in the truck. Good, fine, Sohento. This could be useful. They won't have a screwdriver. Are you adding that to your grappler? No, hold us. You have to make do with whatever you find. What are you going to do with that? Que chimba! Black Hand are coming, Sargento! Mierda! Listo, I'll drive the truck. I've got a chopper nearby waiting to extract this. Make sure you get there in one piece. Gracias, parcero. We're moving out! They're coming! Vámonos! Let's get out of here! That balloon thing is pretty cool, huh? I think it'll come in handy. Where'd you learn to plan an ambush? Out of Abismo. You came out of nowhere, and the Black Hand didn't know what hit him. It was epic. Eh? What's that in the road? Must have been some fighting here. Uh, any ideas, Rico? Oh, yeah. Just one. Come on. You have an intruder on site. Chevre. See, that's what I mean. Stuff like that. Acknowledge. Intruder on site. All units engage. Hostile hasn't re-engaged. Eyes open for further contact. You think I'd make a good agent? Like you? Keep your eyes on the road, Sorrento. Because I think I could do it. I've always wanted to do something important. It's complicated, Sorrento. Listo, listo. Mierda! Again? I'll clear a path. Try those balloons and those black and balloons. Up and away. I learned to improvise a lot in my old life. See? Growing up in the slum, mom dead, dad long gone, you figure stuff out. This is what works for me, Sargento. You find what works for you. The end, yes. For now, just worry about getting us to the extraction point. Extraction? Eat where pucha! I need to call them. Got this, Rico? Listo. Lucan, Lucan, this is Jama. Extraction required at Bravo Station. At Bravo Station. We talked about this. CC, we'll be waiting. Over and out. This is going okay. First mission is bound to have a few, uh... Hiccups. Just focus, Sargento. Drive. They're still coming.
Rico. How am I doing? You work out those hiccups, Sargento, and you could be a real operations master for the army. But I want to be, you know, in the shit, like you. Guess what? We're in the shit right now. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we are. It's getting shot a lot. But extraction's not here yet. We gotta hold them off until that chopper gets here. Lock and load, people. The Black Hand want their supplies back. You okay from here on out? Si, si. Enrico, I heard you. I'll work behind the lines, make sure the army stays stocked and safe. Gracias for the advice. You need an army. You stick together. Yeah. Hey, I think I could call you to help train new recruits? I bet FaceTime with you really boost morale. Hey, sure. Adios, Santo. Guy, Javi Huerta. 
did a job for him a while back. Do you think he might be able to help us out? Maybe. He was trying to take down Espinosa. The truth is, I think you might be able to help him out. I'll look into it. Gracias. Oh, hey, there's something else. Hey, Sarge! You said I could call you on this number? Who are you? And you got Rodriguez conferenced in. Good! Listen, doll, I want to help out your little revolution. Doing a little shoot by the river. Swing by, we'll do lunch. Ciao. Who was that? She's like a movie producer. I ran into her crew near El Abismo. Kept asking her about you. But I mean, it sounds like she wants to help. Just get it done! Hey, go sober up Charlie. Get him working on some new pages with the frogs. Hey, look at you, you handsome devil. Garland King, you've heard of me. No, but I've heard you can help the Army of Chaos. <laughs> Let's not worry about that now. Come on, walk with me. Rico. I love everything about you, man. The look, the swagger, the leather. You're an artist, my friend. The Da Vinci of violence. Which is why I need you for this picture. I don't see what that has uh, to do we'll with. We'll work out the details later. Hey, you see that barely floating rust bucket there? See. I need it to careen through the water. My stuntmen, bless their square jaws. They can take a left hook, but uh, they lack the touch of a true artiste. So here, you take these. And I want you and to... I... Da -da! Details. Just plant them on the rust bucket and send that baby straight to the great dry dock in the sky. King, what's this about frog? That has nothing to do with my story. Hey! Are you in? I suppose I could... Perfect! We'll get your agent a copy of the contract. You don't have an agent. We'll get you an agent. We're gonna do amazing things together, doll. Okay. Hey, Charlie! Fuck your story, all right? You know, that's the old way. We're gonna do something that's never been done before! Hey! Make sure the reel is loaded this time. We don't wanna lose the light. bodyguard i haven't agreed to anything i got a lot of expensive equipment in this van so don't let them wreck us uh, fine i came here to shoot my next picture my magnum opus oh yeah it looks like a paradise but everywhere you go it's permits and they only give you permits if you're espinosa telecom and by the way i'm not espinosa telecom they got this place locked down tighter than a clam's ass at high tide. I love Solis. Wish I had a DP in the car. You're doing beautiful work. You blow stuff up for a living. Most guys just pretend to do it and let the effects department handle the rest. Not you and... Where are we going? Oh, I'm headed to the next shoot. You're gonna fake my death. We just met, and I'm already faking your death. Sport, sport. You're almost wrapped for the day. Come in. We have an intruder on site. Take my van. Get the Black Hand's attention. Damn it. Guess I better find a Black Hand outpost. Lure him away, then wreck the van. Make it look like I died in a big explosion. That's how I always wanted to go. Are you kidding? I wouldn't get about my own death. Make it dramatic. Bombastic! Should buy me a few hours. Hasta luego! Target last known position was on site. Stand by. No further contact. All units stay alert. Calling off search for hostile. Now 
about to wreck this van, I guess. But Izzy's off getting us some intel from a guy in Kuya. Can you make sure she gets to the outpost safely? Can't wait to meet her. Hey, Nico, good chance to test our new pilots, no? Sure. Chevre, go on, give on a call. Mira, Sargento, dropping in over Kuya. Yes! Isis waiting for you on the roof of the Batista building. On my way. There she is. <sighs> nice to meet you. Buenas, hardware. No chopper. Figured you'd bring one. Oh, think I know where to get one. I'd say the pilots are gonna work out fine. Let's go, Easy. Right with you. Mira, where are we going? Listo, just got here. Sending you coordinates. like this part. Straight Thanks for the lift, hardware. Come on. Anytime. Mira, we're here. Que putas. Bien, I'm in the control center. Come on up. Don't be afraid of hitting the stupid mask. Good to go. How's it going, Easy? It's going. We're pushing forward, but none of that matters unless we can disable Yapa's defenses. Isi and I have been working on that. All of these facilities house prototype weather cores, and each core is connected to Yapa's defense network. Mm, towers with artillery. See, si. if we can plant a virus in those weather cores, we can send a message up the network, causing malfunctions in the tower's machinery. Everything breaks, boom, no more artillery. Then we just have the blizzard. One thing at a time, Mira. Tell me more about the facilities housing the weather cores. 
This is Zona 1. It's protected by a sandstorm. Mira, here. Gracias, Izzy. What's that? Information on a place called La Masmora. It's a prison hidden in the desert. Something Gabriela said. I think my Uncle Lanza might still be alive. And if he is, he's being held there. And, uh... He can help us get into Zona 1? He helped your father build Project Iapa. Mira, if he's still alive, I'll find him. Here is Zona Trace. According to Izzy, it's not on the network, but I have an old friend, Cesar. He has a theory that might help us. Then let's hear what he has to say. And this is Zona Dos. We don't know much about that facility. Are you ever going to answer this? I'm not an agency man anymore. Rico, those coordinates are close. Look. Ay, that can't be a coincidence. I'll check it out. I'm sending you all the data you'll need to your AR lens. Good. Let's start hitting Oscar when it hurts. He's up there! Tom Sheldon. Well, I guess you got my message. It's all clear, Mita. I'm on my way. Who's that? Why are you here, Sheldon? When you went dark after Medici, I figured I'd look through some of your old files. See where you might end up. Turns out your dad was working with Oscar Espinosa back in the day. Something called Project Iapa. What do you know about Iapa? I know there's lots of buzz about Solis at the agency these days. Talk of weather modification technology, strategic atmospherics. Of course, once the higher-ups heard that I was looking at those Iapa files, I ended up on administrative leave. Guess I'm not the only one who doesn't trust Tom Sheldon. I know you're looking to take out Iapa, Rico. I've already done some of the legwork. You screwed me over more than once in Medici. I don't want your help, Sheldon. Well, you're gonna need it. I did some snooping around Zona Dos. <clears throat> Turns out that place is constantly surrounded by a nasty lightning storm. Fried poor Annabelle here. That seems pretty suspicious to have a standing lightning storm like that, don't you think? This a friend of yours, Rico? Not exactly. Mira Morales. This is Tom Sheldon. I've known him for 20 years. He cannot be trusted. Buenas. Don't listen to this guy, senorita. Pleased to meet you. Uh, Rico and I were just discussing the situation with Zona Dos. And you know how to access the core? I don't know anything about the core, but I got a good idea how to get us past that lightning storm. Good luck with Annabelle, Sheldon. We'll figure something else out. He's got a plan, Rico. And we don't. Duck. Okay. Now there's a river that runs underneath the facility. I figure we use a boat to get close. You remember the Stingray base back in Medici? The same basic concept. Do you want to make a lightning-proof boat? 
Yeah, bingo. Now, I also hear there's a nearby research lab that's testing a way to harness lightning. Figure we find something there to protect the boat, spare us poor Annabelle's fate. You're talking about that facility in the mountains, Mediolab. <laughs> you got it. And we could do the custom boat work at Prospero Astiero. Interesting. Yeah, coming around, aren't you? Why are you doing this, Sheldon? <laughs> well... Because I owe you, Rico. You want to take out Iapa? I want to help you do it. Besides, we both know we can't have just anybody running around with a weather weapon, for God's sakes. You got a better idea? Shit. That's what I like to hear. So, we meet up at Medio Lab when we're ready? Sounds good. You know, for a minute there, I thought you were going to shoot me. <laughs> Not this time, Sheldon. The revolutionary. You must be Javi. I am not. This little time to explain. Javi said you would be able to bring him the equipment he needs. Did he? The Black Hand have confiscated his things over by the waterfall. If you defeat them, you can take his equipment to him at the Tomb of Sama. You can't be in this area. You know that. Engage in the Senor Rodriguez, this is Avi Huerta. I'm sorry we weren't able to meet. This better be worth it, amigo. It is. I promise you. We've lost the target. Stand down for now. This is some place, Javi. An aqueduct. At least six centuries old. And sealed off by the Black Hand since its discovery. Uh huh. I promise, I will explain everything. There's a map inside the plane. You can get my coordinates from there. Got your map. Where am I going? I'd like to begin with where you're coming from. That aqueduct is hidden behind those doors for a reason. For years, I have gathered evidence that the indigenous peoples of Solis were more advanced than we've been told. The Espinosas didn't like anyone challenging their narrative. I was imprisoned, my wife won't speak to me, my reputation is ruined. Your shady friends seem to think you are okay. I made allies in prison. People who'd seen the cracks in the facade. Now they help me uncover the truth. And what do you need me for? I believe I have discovered the path to the tomb of Otorongo, last ruler of the pre-Espinosa people of Solis. According to the history books, Otorongo was executed for countless murders, but I believe the reality is more complex and dangerous. To who? The Espinosas. Their monopoly. If this part of history is not true, what else might be false? Histories. Criminal records, election results. Truth is a commodity to the wealthy. Dropping off plata and kaching. Your lie becomes the law. You had a lot of time to think in prison, huh? You have no idea, Senor Rodriguez. Find me at the mouth of the cenote when you arrive. The what? Ah, a cave in the top of the mountain.
Javi Huerta. Did you bring what I asked? See, si. your stash is safe for now. You want to put that gun down? It's not a gun, Senor Rodriguez. It's a relic. A figure of Otorongo. Mid 16th century. So, were you going to hit me with that? Hit you? <laughs> I was going to run away with it. To protect it. It's very precious. Hmm. See, si, the Black were very interested in your collection. Yes, well, uh, the truth is a very powerful weapon. Oscar Espinosa fears that I will use it against him. And you really think what you find in Otorongo's tomb can help you take down Espinosa? Take down? Perhaps not. Discredit? Most definitely. And this is Otorongo's tomb? Oh, hardly. No, this is merely the tomb of his servant, Sumak. But I've been unable to proceed further without my retract motor. Did you bring it? <laughs> I see. Bueno. Let's begin. That object is why we need the retract motor, Rico. I believe it is connected to underground machinery. That sounded like... something. I see it. A giant head. Rico, follow it. I can tell what kind of day this is going to be. sculpture of an honored person. This one may be Sumak's visage. Avi, big guy and I are at the floor of the cave. What do you see? There's a mechanism in the ground. Looks about the same size as the head. It's a giant lock, Rico. The Uma is the key. Can you use the retract to get the Uma to the mechanism? Why not? Something happened. A door opened up. It must be the vault, where Sumak sleeps eternal. There's a human skull with a candle inside. Light it, and be ready for anything. There's text on the wall. I'm buried, only five beds remain. That mean anything to you? No. It sounds like a single line from a longer text. There must be more. If it's gonna screw over Espinosa, count me in. Bueno, others close to Otorongo will likely have the other lines. The tombs of his family, his advisors. I'll keep my eyes open. Is this it? Mm hmm. According to the data you retrieved, the ion coil in here creates positive streamers which stimulate electrical storms. So it makes lightning? Uh, no. It creates a positive charge which draws negative charges to it. So, lightning will strike the ion coil and not anything around it. So it absorbs lightning. How do we get it out of there? We need to get around the failsafe system. There are lightning rods protecting this area. Deploy those rods and the failsafes release the coil. Lightning rods? I thought you said this thing absorbs lightning. If Mira says it'll work, it'll work. I know, I'm just messing with her. I'll go raise the lightning rods. He used to be a lot easier to get along with. We get along fine. Come on, let's get inside. Storm's rolling in. Force the rods up. That should trigger the failsafe and release the coil. I 
found the first lightning rod. There should be a breaker nearby. Sleeping it will force the rod up. There's one. Bien. Staying near an active rod will protect you from lightning strikes. And if I'm not near one? Without a positive charge, the negative charge... Move it or lose it, kid. If you're about to get struck by lightning, Rico, just move as fast and as far as you can. Move fast. Copy. How's it going out there? A little... Jesus, Rico! You all right? Oh, yeah. It's about to strike, kid. Found the last lightning rod. Here we go. Last lightning rod is up. And I'm so... Head back to the console and you'll be able to raise the ion foot. Shit. What is it? Coffee's too hot. Burp a mouth. are coming back up. That should do it. We'll get to work extracting the coil. Hell yeah, we did it, kid. Yeah, nice teamwork, Sheldon. Now find me a towel. You look cold. Here. Work with me, kid. I'm living up to my end of the bargain. You and me? We've got a long way to go. How many deposed dictators later, and you're still the same asshole you were at 17? If I were 17, I wouldn't feel so banged up right now. You remember when you used to dress like a Mexican Johnny Cash? What's wrong with Johnny Cash? Nothing. There's nothing wrong with Johnny Cash. It's just not the most practical way to dress for a war. <laughs> Whatever you say, hula shirt. Well, there's nothing wrong with a hula shirt. Hey, it's just not the most practical way to dress for a war. Give me that. Where's Mira? We're ready to go. Needed elsewhere. She asked me to drive instead, which I'm assuming is her version of running the parent trap. A parent trap? Yeah, she's tricking us into working together as a team. <sighs> Come on. Let's get this iron coil to Prospero Astiero. Mind if I drive? I'd rather not end up wrapped around the catbook tree. You're not still sore about that fruit stand in Patagonia, are you? We got there. Eventually. Hey, move over. Off we go. All systems go. Let's get this show on the road, amigo. So 
Oh, there's Mira character. How did you end up in cahoots? Came to find me in Medici. Told me my father built some sort of weapon. You know, kid, if you'd answered any one of my hundred calls, I could have told you the same. All you do is manipulate the truth, Sheldon. It's only later that I find out what you're really after. Jesus, kid, is that really what it's come to? Shall we talk about what happened in Medici? Fine. If that's the way you want this dance to go, then that's the way it'll go. Roadblock ahead, Rico. I see it. starting. shooting earlier. Thanks.
Your people work fast. Now, you and Mira got quite an operation going here. They just want things here to change. How's it feel? Having an army. He's growing on me. <laughs> Seems like it. Well, I always thought leadership suited you, kid. We better make sure that boat has some firepower. Mir and I got it all under control. We'll uh, have her ship shaped for you in no time. <laughs> what? Oh, hey, Rico. What do you want to name her? Turkosho, then. How about Thunderbarge? <laughs> the boat's ready. See, si. and not a moment too soon. The Black Hand are setting up patrols all along the Rio and I. They're putting the pieces together. We're running out of time. Get airborne. When we reach Zona Dos, I'll disable the cord that's controlling the storm. As soon as this storm clears... I'll fly in and use the cord to access the Yapa network bringing down the defense node. Bueno, Sheldon, show with me. What do we know about the Lightning Corps' defenses? Well, aside from lightning, <laughs> uh, there's some shielding held in place by magnetic locks, but we'll take care of the locks once we get in there. And we gave you that extra firepower you asked for. Could be useful. Hmm. 50 cal, mortar, anything else? You'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Meet you there. You ready? Just like old times, amigo. Think these boats really gonna protect us from the lightning? Absolutely! But why else would I have volunteered to sit at the highest point of the vessel with my hands wrapped around a giant piece of metal? They come. on those doors. Watch the boat. Looks like they did it. 
Breakfast Team Ahead. Nervous, Sheldon. Yeah, a little. That's what makes it fun, though.
Mira, Ram. I'm inbound. I need a team to secure the lightning core. And she'll be able to take out that defense node from there. She's good. Let's leave her to it then. I got something to show you. What is this, Sheldon? Well, when I was researching Solis and your father's situation, I heard about an old agency outpost used to be near here. Why didn't you tell me this before? Well, I didn't want to get your hopes up, but I thought we might find something out about your old man. Now, this was his project, after all. Let's see here. Been here a while. Yeah, at least 30 years, I'd reckon. A surveillance outpost. This must have been where they kept tabs on the Ayapa project. Espinoza, your dad, and the weather technology. How long has the agency known about this? Here. This looks like a good place to start. Hey, still works. The Yapa project. This is interesting. What did you find? Surveillance footage. Your dad's name is in the file. Miguel Rodriguez. Play it. Do you have any idea what I sacrificed for Project Yapa? Miguel. No, I refuse to play part in this any longer. Good luck finishing Iapa without me or my work. If Miguel Rodriguez is allowed to leave this project, he'll be a serious liability. If we were to take care of that liability now, Lanza Morales' work on Zona Uno would suffer. No. Let Miguel leave. Let Lanza hear that he reunited with his family. Then what? I have Black Hand in Medici under the command of Sebastiano Di Ravello. Who, last I checked, is in the agency's pocket. I need to speak to General Di Ravello. <sighs> Thank you for your contribution to Project Diapa, Miguel. <laughs> Rico, I had no idea. You gotta believe me. It never made any sense why Di Ravello killed my parents. It was the agency and Espinosa using that idiot dictator's crew as a cover. How could you not know anything about this? I didn't know anything about Project Iapa or your parents or any of this back then. I was brand new at the agency. This sort of thing was way above my pay grade. I only had orders to save you. I'll tell you this, kid. You and me? We're gonna end Oscar Espinoza and take out Project Iapa together. I knew the agency was dirty, but... Look, why don't you head topside, get some fresh air. I'll keep snooping around here, okay? You let me know if you find anything else. Dean and ready to go. You? Nothing to report. Everything okay? 
You sound... Bring it down. Okay. you think? Will that thing fly? <sighs> Just get in. Want me to run you through pre-flight? <sighs> Didn't think so. Let's get in the air. Unidentified aircraft. This is AGB Tower. You are entering restricted airspace. Divert your flight path immediately. I've got this. AGB, this is Black Hand 773 inbound. Security call 179er Niner. Request clearance to land at AGB main runway. Copy 773. You are clear for landing at AGB. Nicely done. Told you she could be trusted. She's meeting us at Hangar 6. Just land quietly. Sure. Real quiet. No. Black hand. Command, you have an intruder on site. Copy on hostile contact. We do engage. Mirta. Sorry about your friend. Now's not the time. We need to get to that ATC tower. I'll find us a ride. Let's go. So, what's the plan now? One thing at a time, Rico. A plan is a list of things that go wrong, right? 
I remember saying that right before I got my ass kicked. Hey, so let me think. Any ideas yet? Maybe. See, if we can restart the ATC systems, I should still be able to slip the malware in. How do we restart the system? I got it. Easy. Buenas. Punch up some code that will cause the jetway consoles to infinitely ping the ATC system for permission to open. That's it. No problem. Rico, you'll have to move fast to get those programs running on every console. Copy. I uploaded the goods to Rico's grappling gizmo. Gracias, Sisi. Listo. Head to unoccupied jetways and plug EC's code into the consoles there. Sargento! Si, senora. I'm marking your targets, Rico. Hostile hasn't re-engaged. Eyes open for further contact. Command, we have an intruder on site. Copy on hostile contact. Free to engage. Here goes nothing. Yeah, you'll need to get all the consoles for this to work, though. How's it going? It's gonna take a few minutes. Just cover me.
airport is useless now. Let's get out of here. Find us a getaway vehicle. Where to? Guya. Sargento, have someone meet me there for evac. They're on their way, marking the point for you. Air support is on. Rico. 
Listen, Cesar, he, uh, he doesn't spend much time around people. Not anymore. Hmm. This is the secret agent? See, si, this is Rico. Mira says you have something to show me. Proof. Proof that none of the weather occurring in Solis is natural. <laughs> Come on, the back. I've got a... Who put that there? Uh, just one minute and I'll have this... I've been looking for that. Okay, uh, right here. I'll plug this in and... Okay, now do Remember, Cesar, stick to what we talked about. See, si, see, si. okay, okay. Okay. The tornado that hit Nueva was the capital, ten years ago. Mina Vendaval a few months later. My plane. All destroyed by tornadoes. Tornadoes controlled by the reptilians. Mierda, Cesar. Or the Nordics, but I've definitely ruled out the Greys. <laughs> no abductions. Mira. Cesar. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. Watch this. How'd you explain that, huh? Appears out of nowhere, and moments later, a tornado forms around it. Look familiar? Play that again. You've seen it too, haven't you? Go on. I've seen it here and here. This is near Yapa, and this is on a trace. An alien weather. A weather research facility. Both Yapa and Sonatres are funded by... Oscar Espanosa. The man behind it all. If he even is a man. Let's assume he is a man. Hmm? Do you think this UFO is a core we could use to hack into the Yapa network? If we can get to it, see. Si. Impossible. It's inside a tornado. What if I dive down? Dive down. Into the eye of a tornado. So. How do we make it happen? I say, we start with this. Let's go over it one more time, bien? <clears throat> okay. We need to trap and grow a tornado. To do that, we need the wing cannons from the alien weather lab to steer it to the capital. To know where to place the wind cannons. I will use the radar equipment at Ojo de la Pradera. I will need to follow and track the tornado. I'll drive the storm chaser. To build the storm chaser? Si, si. Uh, we need to bring some of the alien weather tracking equipment from the alien weather lab. Si, sir. From Zona Trace to Prisa Automobile. And when the time is right, the army disables the wind cannons protecting Mina Vendaval. That will allow the tornado to go towards Nueva Voz. Which the army will evacuate. We build a perimeter of wind cannons around Torre Espinosa. And we grow the tornado there until it's big enough. Then I jump in on Cesar's UFO and do something. What do we think? <laughs> he's fucking nuts. <laughs> and that's why he's gonna work. Let's get it in by 0500, yeah? All right, we're ready. Let's get going. The last of the storm chaser equipment is being loaded. What about the data I extracted? Did you learn anything? Cesar's UFO? I was right. It's one of the prototype cores, only this one is mobile. It works by disrupting the surrounding air temperature. And then this machine creates an artificial updraft and... 
Moments later. A tornado rips through Solis. Espinosa is testing a weather weapon on his own people. And he tells us Iapa will be our salvation. <laughs> pues, we can't control the tornado core from here, but if you can plug this into the core's flight controller, then I can hijack it and remotely sever its link to the Iapa network. You need to be close for this to work. Ever fight near a tornado? Ever dive into one? <laughs> Where is Cesar? I thought he'd be here by now. Oh, I'm not sure he's ready for all this just yet. <laughs> we taking bets? Did you get everything I asked for? Claro que sí. Ultrasonic anemometer. Yes. Image console. Cesar, CB all the gear you requested is good to go. Hmm? I'll fly. I'm not so sure about this. I'll fly the helicopter to Prisa Auto. Agale! You sound sure to me. Okay. But you've never flown with him. Let's go build a storm chaser. You've flown one of those before, right? It's taking a minute to adjust to the pendulum effect. Here we go! Guys, the Black Hand are setting up roadblocks. Be careful. Are they going to shoot at us? Not if I have any people say about it. Hey, uh, have you ever read Mechanical Failure? You're trying to tell me something? What? No, no. It's a good book. We're good. When I flew from Savion, I would pre-flight every aircraft. Bien, Cesar. I was a great pilot, but uh, when you see an alien spacecraft during a routine flight and you report it, but they don't listen, so you divert your flights to get photos, and you show them photos, but they still say you're insane, well... You get fired? See? You get fired. Uh, once we catch that tornado and pin down this spacecraft inside, and the whole world knows Espinosa's an alien, then we'll see who's laughing. What if he's not an alien? You'll see. Rico, Cesar, we're detecting surface-to-air missile launchers ahead. What? Just hang back, Cesar. I'll deal with the Sams. Last one. Am I clear yet? One more. You're clear, Cesar. Please stop. Headed to your position. Dios mío, they're coming after me! Cesar, listen to me. Just keep flying and I'll cover you. You can do this. Just keep flying. See? Okay, I can do this. I'm taking a lot of damage, Rico! Cesar. Guys, we've got some friendly anti-air up ahead. They'll keep the black hand off your back once you're past them. Free of the black. 
Black Hand now. Heading to Prisa Auto. You did good, Cesar. Did I? Bien. Let's get that weather equipment in sight so you can get to work. Vale. Getting into position. Hostile hazard. With the weather tracking equipment installed, it brings the total vehicle weight to 7,500 kilos. Very nice. Windproof. But we still need to insulate the interior with tin foil. Uh, see? In the back. Why would we need to insulate the storm chaser with tin foil? Um, reptilians have been documented using weaponized gamma radiation. Pero. Tin foil won't help. You need at least two inches of lead shielding to stop gamma rays. Oh. Okay. Everyone back to work. She looks good. Composite plating. Do you want more tempered glass? I thought we needed an upgrade after they started shooting at us. Horsepower? 625. Th does that happen a lot? Want me getting shot at? No, not really. Yes. All the time. You'll probably want to get used to it too, huh? Uh, how do I do that? I don't know. Get shot at more? Tape deck. I didn't think it was important. You don't think music's important? I thought that building a tornado-proof storm chaser was more important. Yeah, no, I, I guess music is important too, sure. Bueno. Let me know when she's actually ready, hmm? Okay, so I'll, I'll just put in a tape deck then and... practice getting shot at more. Tanto and his team need to set up the wind cannons in the wave of us. But there's a problem. The city is crawling with Black Hand. You need a distraction. Head into the wave of us. Find a Black Hand tank. I've marked one for you. What's your plan? Steal the tank. When the Black Hand come looking for it, we ambush them and give Sargento's team a chance to set up those wind cannons. No problem. Found the tank. Bien. Bring the tank to these coordinates. This ah! ah! roll.
Next time, let's do something faster. I'm in position. Perfect timing. We've got a tornado. Bueno, get back to the city. I'm already on it. Cesar, check in. Copy that. I'm following the tornado. Storm Chaser's performing beautifully. I'm on my way to Nueva Boss. See you soon. You hear that? Rico! The Black Hander here! Rico! Say again. Mira, the Black Hand are trying to secure the wind cannons. Mierda. If we don't destroy them, they'll deflect a the tornado and our plan is fucked. Continue to the city. I'll take care of the wind cannons. I'm heading for the wind cannons. Mira, if the Black Hand are here. See, si, they know what we're up to. Warn our troops. We're in for a fight. The Black Hand are on to us! Kick their asses! the wind cannon. Easy. Destroy the combustion chambers on the side first. There we go. Now destroy that rear intake van and the wind cannon is useless. That's one down. the cannons on this side. There's one more wind cannon on the other side of the canyon. On my way. Boy, 
on it. We need to get this tornado through the mine. Better hurry. Thank you, Cesar. Last cannon. for me down there, Cesar. I'm on my way. Copy. See what this thing can do. See, si, thank you. Stay as close as you can to the tornado. I need to get the necessary readings. Let's roll. Is this a tape deck? Uh, yeah. I made a mixtape. Play it.
They've got half a dozen cannons to hold the tornado here, but you only need to take out the ones blocking its path. Flag them. Already done. Hostile in our area of operation. Copy on hostile contact. We're doing age. the tower. This place is a war zone. Cesar, what is it? I tried to break through a black hand roadblock and, uh, well, I'm surrounded. The storm chaser is holding up for now, but... I'm coming. Sit back, I'll handle this. That was amazing. Yeah, you're pretty good at getting shot at. Now get to the vantage point. See, si, see. Si. I can't wait to see this UFO up close. Mira, Cersei's almost in position. Good, so am I. You should get to higher ground. The show's about to start. Dora Espinosa is down. <laughs> All right, stand by. Engaging cannons. Now. Wing cannons online. It's working! Good job, people. Good job! The Black Hand are attacking! We have to protect those wing cannons! There's too many of them! Hold your ground. I've got this. Hold them 
off.
Come in, Rico. <sighs> Lost him. Mira, look. Mira, I'm on the Tornado Corps. Uh, what am I looking for? Look for an access panel. It should be near the center of the core. Believe this. Everybody come check this out. Oh, you all doubted me, but <laughs> now I have proof. Proof that the reptilians have infiltrated the highest levels of government. Proof that Oscar Espinosa hails from the Alpha Draconis system. Proof that no human could have created. Is this a USB port? Is this a USB port? What kind of alien ship has a USB port? Yeah, sorry, Cesar. That thing is man-made. But... Espinosa may not have been one of your lizard men. Reptilians. But his UFO has killed hundreds of his own people. And now he's exposed. You've uncovered a real conspiracy, Cesar. Hey, guys. You're gonna wanna check this out. What is this? The Tornado Corps wasn't the only one that was mobile. This one was a prototype, but there's another more advanced device under construction at Iapa. Can you use this to disable the defensive node? <sighs> See, the virus is ready. We just need to send it. What are we waiting for? Yeah, I can. Can I be the one that sends it? You're good to go. Just hit enter. Take this, you non-alien motherfucker! What are we doing out here? Couldn't rescue over comms. Too big. What's going on, Sargento? You know how the Black Hand are forces overseas? Mercenaries who keep the money coming in? We've crossed paths before. I pieced together some of the intel you helped us recover. Those offshore forces are planning to invade Solis. Oh, mierda. See, but the point is, I know how to stop them. They're establishing a beach at west of here. Give me the coordinates. No, 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 no. Wait, wait. Let me take care of this, Rico. We've talked about this. We did, and I do know I'm best behind the lines, but I need this one. I can do this. I planned it perfectly. Mm. We can do more than blow the beach, Enrico. If I can get down to the comm station on the beach, I can message the Black Hand overseas, call off the invasion. You really think you can make it work? I just need you to cover me. Fine. Let's do it. Gracias, Rico. Let's go. I won't let you down. I know you want Sorrento. Hey, gracias again for doing this, Rico. Vámonos, Sorrento. The invasion force is landing south of Puerto Diego and securing the roads leading to the beach. We'll need to take out their scouts. Stop them from warning the main force. I thought so too. Intel says there aren't too many of them. Drive in fast, and we'll destroy the comms equipment. Listo. Here we go.
Perfecto. They won't even know we're coming. All right, let's go. So you tangled with the Black Hand before Solis, huh? San Espirito, Medici, they pop up in places where there's trouble. Hey, and so do you, huh? You sometimes, sometimes I bring the trouble with me. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Next one's up here. Off the road a bit. Eyes open for further contact. Hostile in here. Up the hill. That's the last of the comms. Eso, let's get going. <sighs> this is going good, Rico. Huevones won't even know we're coming. Don't get cocky. Plenty can still go wrong. I'm not cocky, just uh, cautiously confident. <laughs> Good man. No further contact. All units, stay alert. Arms equipment is mine. And we're done. Hostile has been re-engaged. Almost there. The beachhead is right over this next rise. Ready when you are. We're gonna take them completely by surprise. This is it. There's a good overlook to the north. I'll cover you. Target last no position was on site. Stand by.
can kill two birds with one stone. Engage their commanders, and I'll send the all clear while they're distracted. Hmm. Good plan. Let's do it. Hey, gracias, Rico. No further contact. All units, stay alert. for another day, thanks to you. This is amazing. The war could have been lost, but we stopped it. You and me. No, you stopped it. I just helped. Go have a drink, Sorrento. You earned it.
Small outpost, not heavily guarded. But there's an elevator that goes into the ground. That must be La Masmora. The elevator's probably locked down. Look for a console that will give you access. Copy. It's waiting for confirmation from the watchtowers. Then get there fast, Rico. The system will expect verification from all three towers before it grants access to the elevator. That's one. Down. One to go. That's all of them. Elevators open. I'll let you know when I'm on my way down. Heading down. Looks like his intel was good. Please, be careful, Rico. If your uncle is down here, get him out alive. I know you will. Big facility. Looks like a prisoner intake area. Keep going forward. Hopefully there's a security station with some records. the security station. Anything? I'll let you know. Oh. At the console, looking. Mira, I found your uncle. Cell box C4. Lanza Morales. Gracias a Dios, Rico. Hurry! This is massive. There must be hundreds of prisoners down here. And it's Espinosa's private facility. The Black Hunt run this place without any oversight. A lot of security down here. A lot of valuable prisoners, and they bury them out here for a reason. Yeah. Here it is, cell box C4. Stand by, Mira.
Alfonso Morales! Who are you? What's happening? Prison break. You need to come with me. I can't leave my work. We'll come back for it. Vente. Do not let Morales out of your life. Guess they want you dead. I must have outlived my usefulness. Hostile in our area of operation. Uh, whoever you are, thank you for helping me escape. Don't thank me until we're on the surface. Just keep your head down. I'll deal with the black hand. get past. If you can find another way around, you should be able to flip the breakers. They should retract then. Wait there. Did my niece send you to help me? We need to get out of here alive first, Lanza. Questions later. Find the breakers and shut it down. One black hand unit, stand by for more intel.
door. Let me take a look at that console. Hostile has been re-engaged. Eyes open for further contact. I thought so. They got us locked out. I have to figure out a way to override it. I'll cover you. Yes, Senor Rico Rodriguez. I believe you knew my father, Miguel. You're Miguel's boy? <laughs> I've seen pictures. I was sorry to hear about your father, Rico. He was a good man. I've heard differently. What do you mean? Pequeña! Oh. 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 I, I just can't believe it. I didn't think I'd see you ever again. Oh, me. Ah. Let me look at you. I thought I'd lost you forever, Tio. We need to get out of here. This place is no secure yet. Go with Mira. I'll catch up once we take him to prison. Rico Rodriguez, how can I ever repay you? By helping me destroy Project Iapa and Oscar Spinoza. Anything for Miguel Rodriguez, son. My pequeños. 
They've changed so much. I don't know where I went wrong with my Gabriella. <laughs> Sometimes family can surprise you. <laughs> Is that why you say your father was not a good man? He was one of the chief architects of a weapon of mass destruction. Not when we started, Rico. Project Iyapa was meant to save lives. Imagine the ability to disperse tornadoes before they fall. <laughs> to bring rain to drought-stricken areas. Mm. Espinosa seems to have another agenda. Ask her. <laughs> he thought his father was squandering his family's fortune on this altruistic project. When he took over, he changed our direction. He wanted us to weaponize Iyapa's technology so he could sell it to the highest bidder. Go help me with this, por favor. <clears throat> but once we were working on a weapons project, your father stopped his work and he left Solis at once. Oscar sent my own daughter my Gabriella to arrest me. And my niece thought I was dead. So I ended up here, still working on a weather weapon, but now from a cell. You've been working on Zona Uno this whole time. <laughs> I had indeed. You ready, Tio? I believe so. Yes. Kill the lights. So, you have a plan, Lanza? As I said, I've been working on Zona Uno. Your father's departure sent Oscar back a decade. The bastard needed my help just to recover the time he lost. But I also built in a flaw. Flaw? A flaw that will allow us to access the core. But first, we need to get into Zona Uno. Its core was our first major breakthrough in weather modification. We thought the best place to test your father's theory was the desert. The result was total control of a sandstorm. Hmm. We're taking the train. We rode the train every day into Zona Uno. The sandstorms may travel difficult, but the tracks are still there. If we wait the train down enough, the winds of the sandstorm won't affect it. Exactly, Mira. You'll need some heavy armor. There are armored trains at Estacion Atalaya. We can probably get something there. We should be able to retrofit a standard train chassis. From Grand Central, we should be able to secure a train without too much trouble. Then we just need a place to do the adjustment somewhere near Zona Uno. Estacion Perdida. Estacion Perdida. We can do the work there. I think we have a train. That gets us into Zona Uno. But what happens when we get there? What's this flaw? The shielding there is segmented. I positioned it to Oscar as a failsafe. For ventilation? The shield opens to ventilate the sandstorm core if it overheats. And once the shield is open? That's where it gets interesting. Once the shield is open, I will need to personally climb the structure and manually release the locking clamps on the shield. Then we should be able to dismantle the power... What if... We put a giant gun on the train instead? A giant gun? See, si. You shoot the armor once it's ventilated. The force of a large artillery shell should be sufficient to dislodge the shielding once it's been opened and leave the core intact. Well, what? You hadn't thought of that, Tio? <laughs> <laughs> Where do we get a gun like that? Prospero Torretas. They put some high-caliber weaponry on their torts. And once we shut off the armor? The core will be exposed. I'll hack in and disable one of Yapa's defense nodes. Okay. Let's get started.
get on that train, Rico, and keep it moving till you reach the drop-off. It's woke. the train. He's automated. Black hand manning those guns, though. You should probably punch their ticket. We have a train hijacking in progress. Scramble choppers. Now!
weapons shipment. Destroy it immediately. Looks like the Black Hand would rather blow this thing up than let us have it. Well, that's typical. Hold them off. I'm sending you reinforcements. Sorrento, call out targets for Rico. Time to see what this baby can do. Hey, Rico. Nice teamwork, eh? Are you all right, Rico? Yeah, Lanza. I think the cannon is going to work out just fine. I wish I could have seen it in action. You will. Mira's plan to use Oscar's own technology against him is inspired. <laughs> Destroying the network from the outside in. Genius. You were clearly a strong influence on her. I never apologize to you for continuing my work on Project Ayapa after your father left. Helping me take down Zono Uno is apology enough. I wish Miguel could see all you've accomplished here. You've grown into a strong man, Rico Rodriguez. 
And you are changing Solis for the better. I'm changing Solis, all right. We'll see if it's for the better. I'm sure we will. But first... Zona Uno. Zona Uno. Excited, Lanza. To finish what I started years ago? Yes. To charge headlong into a sandstorm. <laughs> Less so. Don't forget all the trained soldiers who want to stop you. <laughs> I leave them to you. Some black hand activity coming up ahead of your position. Copy that. Just keep the train moving, Lanza. I'll deal with the black hand. The cannon is all yours, my young friend. The train is heavily armored, Lanza. I trust my design. But the explosion, the gunfire, it's unnerving. You're doing fine. Rico, in front of us. I'll take care of it. We're about to pass through a wave of the sandstorm. I'm ready. Sand 
storm is clogging the engine. No further contact. All units, stay alert. Seating docks. Can you repair the engines? It will take a moment. Do it. I'll cover you. Dio, Rico. The Black Hand are scrambling bombers. Shit. Work fast, Lanza. Uh, shoot straight, Rico. Bombers, to the left of the train, Rico. Here they come. They coming. Still working. There's sand everywhere. We knew we were taking this thing into a sandstorm, didn't we? Well, there's a lot of sand.
on the ground. The cooling unit keeping the core from overheating need to be destroyed. Once they're destroyed, we use the floor I built into the system to ventilate the core. system. Destroy it. Thoroughly. That's how I roll.
enthusiasm for destruction is awe-inspiring. You have no idea, Theo. systems are all destroyed. Good. Return to the console and trigger the failsafe. I'm on my way. I'm plugged into the network. Do you want to do the honor, Steel? No. My work on Zona Uno is complete. I want to see what this program of yours can do. Rico, the poem. It was brilliant. And I finally figured it out. So, you found Old Man Otorongo's tomb? It's right here. Built on the ruins of Otorongo City. His tomb is buried below. What do we do now? There are five Umas here. Some were taken to museums. Some still stand in their original places. But they are here. And there are five locks in the park below. It is Otorongo's tomb. It must be. Can you believe? 
believe these people? Subjecting this priceless relic to such nonsense. Music's got a good beat. Far in the east, interred among on the forest mountains breaking waves along the ocean shore. Where else could it be but this beautiful landscape, which the Alpa people called home? came out of the ground. Miraculous. centuries we've been told these giant heads were mere curiosities. People took selfies with them. My empire there lies dead and buried. Only five beds remain, awaiting the grim faces of my forebears. The seat of Otorongo's empire was here, until the Espinosas began to erect their own city on top of it. And this is where he locked away his secrets using the great Umas as his keys. Another statue. Yes. Yes. city that was once here. It was surely the eighth wonder, before Diego Espinosa tore it apart brick by brick. And the poem was written in the language of the Espinosa conquistadors. Otorongo possessed such foresight. He knew that few or none of his descendants would speak the Quechua tongue.
drive by every day. It never grasps the significance of what surrounds them. It's supportive of our time, see or no? This is remarkable. We're making history, Rico. Why are you out of breath? Lots of stairs. No elevator? This is the last one. When the tomb is revealed, we should be ready. We may need to leave in a hurry. That's all of them. I'm coming. Nice. Listo. Let's go. Hurry. This is amazing, Rico. I am truly giddy. We have a Torongo sarcophagus. What treasures will we uncover inside? Something tells me you'll be more jazzed about it than me. <laughs> but the truth should excite all of us, Rico. Espinosa and his family. All terrible people. Generations of them. Exposed for liars. Thieves. Murderers. We cannot leave the tomb. I will call one of my men for extraction. Please, Rico, bring us a vehicle that can haul the sarcophagus to safety.
Up here. One of my men is coming with a helicopter. Hostile hasn't re-engaged. Eyes open for further contact. Woman, the fiercest leader of one of the most advanced cultures of the ancient world, was not a king, but a queen. <laughs> a star chart, constellations, look at the detail. Hadid. Transferring ownership of Solis to the Spanish for two pounds of silver. What's that? You say journal, reading in Spanish. That's uh, very interesting. The uh, oils on your skin. Hey, what about the oils on your skin? Dios mío. Otorongo's final days. It describes how her entire family was assassinated one by one by the Conquistador Diego. Espinosa de Malaga. This rewrites all of Solis history. The indigenous peoples were not a warlike tribe of barbarians, but a highly scientific, progressive, and matriarchal society. <sighs> Gracias. Gracias. Gracias, Rico. Bueno. Ayúdame. We'll have to get this someplace safe. There's so much work to be done. There's so much left for you to teach me. So my estad. Massive energy spikes in the Project Yapa installation. That can't be good. I suspect our lizard man is returning to the mothership. Well, it was a joke. Yeah, it's called timing, Procero. Actually, he might be onto something. If there was a launch, that would explain the energy spike. The data we recovered from the tornado core. Espinosa was developing another more advanced mobile weapon. What if he's not under construction? What if he's completed? That was always Oscar's goal, to combine the technology of all three sites. A weapon that can create any kind of storm, anywhere. It's Yapa's final form. Whatever it is, we should probably stop it before it launches. We can't do anything until we deal with the Blizzard Corps protecting Project Yapa. So... What's the play, kid? Lanza, you're in the train. I need you to transport the Storm Chaser to the station at the base of Project Yapa. See, si. Cesar, you and I will take the Storm Chaser into the heart of the blizzard. Then you'll use its equipment to try and find the blizzard core. Once you find it, I take it out. I'll drive. No. Okay. Once the blizzard core is down, we launch the attack. Sargento, you will lead the ground forces. We're taking the tower. You can count on me, Rico. Sheldon. Can you fly a helicopter without crashing? <laughs> Watch it, kid. You're flying the command chopper. Air Sheldon flies again. Just get me to a good vantage point. 
Mira, you have the army. Once we've taken the tower, I need you to shut that launch down. We can't let that final core leave this mountain. That will be tricky. Feel like a chopper ride? Could be fun. Project Diapa ends today. What about Espinosa? Espinosa is mine. That would result in unacceptable collateral damage to our Black Hand forces. And I wouldn't even consider this option, but there is a heavily armed rapple at my front door! I can hold the mountain! You have lost every other research facility! The people of Solis are in open revolt for the first time in 500 years! Rodriguez's army of chaos controls the majority of the island! Project Iapa was the culmination of the Espinosa legacy. A priceless technology that could rebuild our family's fortune. The Storm Corps is all that matters now. Do your best. If it is not enough, I will be forced to do my worst. that they're ready, people. Dio, why are you slowing down? They, uh, they've got power to the track. I'm stuck. Not for long. Sheldon, on me. I'm with you, kid. Let's light them up. Rico, I've got two breakers down there. I'll get them. Rico and I are headed up to 
Cuyapa. Storm intensifying. We don't know how close Espinosa is to launching his mobile core. You need to shut that blizzard down. Swear to friends. console.
What is it? You're about to peek behind the curtain. I... I wish I was there with you. Pull back, Cesar. I can take it from here. Mira, I found the Blizzard core. Bien, before you plug in the virus, you'll need to disable the force stabilizers on the core shielding. Got it. Cut off the power to the core. Will it stop the launch? It's worth a shot. Give him hell, Rico. We've lost the target. Stand down for now. Mira, what am I looking for? There are turbines inside that relay power from the superstructure into the core. Expose them and blow them up!
that storm core's not going anywhere. Time to pay Oscar Espinosa a visit. Espinosa, give me everything you've got, you son of a bitch! Rico Rodriguez, do you have an appointment? Have anybody bigger? One moment, let me see what I can dig up. gonna throw away. Friggish words from a man who started a civil war, pitting brother against sister. Can nothing stop you, Senor Rodriguez? Let's find out. Fire this off real quick. Bien. You now have my complete attention. Sorry I couldn't be there in person. I have an important meeting with your old friends at the agency. The agency you conspired with to murder my father. Such a shame. Your father's brilliant work was the foundation on which Project Diapo was built. And as for you... Your army's steady advance gave my scientists just the kick in the pants they needed. Rico Rodriguez. Always doing the agency's bidding, whether he knows it or not. So, should I expect a check? Listen, I have a hard stop in a minute, so I'm going to need to put a bow on this. I will find you. No. No, you won't. Everything... And everyone on that mountain is about to be decimated by the wrath of a thunder god. Once you're all dead, I'll deliver the storm core to the agency and settle accounts. They are incredibly excited to finally receive delivery of their new toy. Your toy is going nowhere, Espinosa. Hmm. The core finished charging a minute or two before you cut the power. It's launching as we speak. Say hello to your father for me, Rico. Take us down. Rico! It's launching! It's going to kill everyone on this mountain.
unplugging you to the flight controller, Mira. Hurry! We're locked out. We can't stop the storm. What is your plan, Rodriguez? Gabriela? I'm open to suggestions. Stand by. We're in. I disabled the firewall. I will not sacrifice the lives of my soldiers for that man's pride. But can you stop this storm? Only Espinosa can stop it. Give Rodriguez the flight controls. And he can steer the storm for us to see. I have a better idea. Rodriguez, your tenacity is commendable. Did my father ever tell you the Rodriguez family motto? It's not something we ever really discussed. Don't fuck with a scorpion. Unless you're prepared to get stung. Wait. Wait, 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 we can make a deal! I mean, you can see why I thought it was aliens. It was a flying saucer, see or not? If I told you about the things we didn't finish... Wait, what? Ay, dígame, dígame. Easy, get over here. You have to try this. Hey, I'm a vegetarian. But it's real American barbecue. Oh, no, no, son. This isn't real American barbecue. This, this is grilling. Now, the only real barbecue comes from Central Texas. <laughs> Just like me. Don't fuck with the scorpion. Something Espinosa said. My father and I have always been pawns in a larger game. Whether we knew it or not. You think that's true? He was. Maybe not in Solis. Well, definitely not in Solis. Destroying Project Yapa must have cost the agency trillions. It always comes back to the agency. That it does. Let's take them down. <laughs> Let's take down the agency. Son of a bitch. All right. I'm in. I'm with you too, Rico. We're with you. We have an army. It's not a bad start. Come on. We'll tell the others in the morning. <laughs> 